let's look at deltoid ligament with ultrasound. So the posterior aspect is best seen dorsiflexed. We are, have our probe on a diagonal from posterior colliculus to the center point of the heel, and we can see the deep posterior tibiotalar ligament is occupied by a bony ossicle here. There may or may not be a superficial posterior tibiotalar ligament over the top, but you can see the talus clearly on the right hand side of the image. If we come a little more forward onto flexor hallucis longus, we see sustentaculum tali, and we're now towards the anterior colliculus. This is the tibiocalcaneal ligament, and it's not always going to be present in everyone, but if it is, it's the third superficial band seen in orange in the top right image. If you rotate slightly more anteriorly, those ligament fibers are going to blend with the tibio spring ligament and the tibio spring ligament is a, a little thicker it's always there and it inserts into a ligament so you don't see a bone on the right hand side of the screen we see tib post over the top and you know that you're on tibio spring because we're seeing the spring ligament to the right of the screen so that's the orange band running from sustentaculum tali to navicular so that's our sustentaculum if you see a little ligament there that's the anterior tibiotalar ligament which we can see partially under spring but partially under this next ligament the tibionavicular ligament now it's the most anterior it's the thinnest and the hardest to find best seen with plantar flexion you can see it there sneaking from the front of the anterior colliculus over the talus onto the navicular now you may not see this ligament either but it's the most commonly injured of the deltoid complex you can see a little ossicle in the anterior tibiotalar ligament beneath the TNL. And that's it.